Hi guys, this is a tutorial on the Rex trick, and the Rex trick looks like that. And for this trick, you're going to need to know how to do a thumb around reverse or fingerless thumb around reverse. Both of them work, but I'm going to be teaching it from a fingerless thumb around reverse because I think it's a bit easier to learn it that way. So, let's get started. First, what you're going to want to practice is just your trick, fingerless thumb around reverse in this case, and catch it with most of the weight of the pen away from your palm. And this is very simple because that's usually how you normally catch it, just like that. And from fingerless thumb around, it just looks like that. So pretty basic, not much I have to tell you about learning this. You just, if you're having trouble, just do it and then slide your hand back. That's very exaggerated, but you should be able to do that pretty easily. And then, once it's here, what you're going to do is just kind of take your hand and turn it, or like move it around the pen like that. So, really, all you're doing is that, and then letting go with your thumb, then going around the pen, and turning your hand back over. So, basically what you're going to do is this, and you're not going to catch it like I had you do before. You're going to just uh, have the pen travel through that position, and as it's moving, you're going to turn your hand with it and then turn your hand up and around the pen and then just catch it like that. So the slow-mo should help with this, but at first I thought that this trick was a reverse thumb around and then like a uh, fingerless thumb around weird palm down thing. But really all you're doing is a little half rotation of the hand around the pen and then turning it, turning your hand to a palm up position. So, yeah, there's really, this trick looks hard. When I first saw it, I'm like, oh man, it's gonna take a long time to learn. But really, it took me 15 minutes, not even exaggerating. This trick looks very hard, which is cool because it'll look good in your combos. But really, it's a very easy trick. Don't be fooled by the way that it looks. It is very simple. So, yeah, that's pretty much the tutorial, guys. This tutorial was suggested by uh, X Shutdown, or Shutdown. He made my intro. He's a good person. And so, yeah. If you want to suggest a tutorial I should make, just leave it in the description. And if you thought this tutorial was helpful, just click the like button, and I'll see you guys in the next video.